Day one, and everybody eager to get off to a good start. Yeah, and it's obvious, Peter, you don't want to be playing catch-up after the opening group game. So we can expect this to be highly competitive. Three points here and the feel-good factor of eventual progression kicks in. It's a, a great foundation to tackle the rest of the, uh, the group games. That gets things running. Sakai. That's a good intervention. That was what he had to make in the face of danger that was growing. Quick ball forward. Brian Ruiz. Move forward and quickly so. It's a fabulous position. And he's there to cut it out. Costa Rica, well, Peter, look how far up the fullbacks are getting now. This is really high. And constantly after the ball, aren't they? Yeah, I think they're they're weighing up their options to see how long they can sustain this and, and suppress those wide opposition players. is dominating proceedings this isn't meeting expectations it's being played forward he's gone down but the referee just tells him to get back up again been clubbed away and it's been taken straight back going through showing good feet played towards the front then moved on forwards done very well to intervene Looking to orchestrate a counter. Costa Rica have a free kick. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Yeah, and he has to change his ways or this referee could soon change his status. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Well, the further he went, the more attention he attracted. There was just way too much pressure for him to get the shot away. And it's Nagatomo. And they've got a throw. There's the shot! Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Well, that's confidence for you. Distance doesn't even bother him. And it's played forward, cuts it out. Nagatomo. Puts it across. And the keeper's in command. And it's half-time here. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goalless.
Stuart Pack on the first 45 minutes. Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. So they head in no further forward. The score here still nil-nil. And we are already promptly back on the way. Japan can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Well, that's down to a simple miscalculation. No more, no less. Well positioned to make that interception. Hit long and direct. That intervention was very necessary. Sends it forward. Very little to report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a cagey old game. Yes, nil-nil and little promise of a goal due to the shot-shy nature of this contest, but I'm not giving up on it. There's plenty of energy on the pitch, not to give up hope just yet. Too much on it, and that's the keepers. He's offering an apologetic gesture of sorts. Clearly is miffed having made the run and not get picked out. Well, that's where he wants it. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. Moved forward and quickly so. Yoshida does well there, alert. Well, now here's a good battle, bicep to bicep. He's through, it's one-on-one! -on -one. Great challenge, time to perfection. Well, they deserve an awful lot of credit for their commitment to the cause, but it's a goal credit that would be most welcome there. And the shot! No mistake! Look, before we can even delve into the detail, the significance of taking the lead should be our initial reflection, and that's priceless. A pretty simple finish in the end, what do you think, Jim? Well, that defence is perplexed by the fact they've allowed him the space. Costa Rica are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Costa Rica break the deadlock. Oh, it was a long time coming, but I think it's fully merited. They've applied themselves extremely well. Japan have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Steered forward. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. So the first game is lost.